Hey guys, what's up? It's Lime. It's Lime here with another video. I know you probably don't expect me to be on your, uh, you be hearing me right now, but I'm back with another video. It's been a while. It's been about three months, but I've decided to come back to YouTube. You know, of quarantine, everything going on. Uh, I've been kind of bored recently, so I decided, hey, why not come back to YouTube and I'm gonna be doing a Rosh, a Washington Redskins Man 20 franchise because. I've been doing some other franchises as Dwayne Haskins going over him real quick. Uh, sh obviously, we're doing the Redskins here. But I've just been kind of bored recently and I've just said, hey, if I'm going to come back, why not do a uh, poll? So I went into my Discord, did a poll there, and uh, you guys answered it. And I'm going to be doing the Washington Redskins. Let's see, giving Antonio Gandy Golden uh, star development there. But yeah, so we're going to come back here and. Hopefully you guys like it. Now, it's been a while, so not very, very rusty at this commentating thing. As you see, Chase Young on your screen gave him Superstar X Factor because with this roster that I added, it has the normal devs because you can't adjust a rookie's development uh, when you implement them into not a into a roster that's not a draft class. So. Implementing him as you see the roster roll over your screen, Tressway and Dustin Hopkins. But yeah, last video that I did was three months ago, so I'm happy to be back. I'm fortunate that uh, quarantine's having to happen, so I have to uh, record here and do some videos. Unfortunate circumstances, as you see, we're gonna be we're gonna be simulating to week three, uh, just because I, I want to have three quarters of our starters and one quarter of our our uh, backups. <laughs> yeah, very rusty at this, as you can tell, but just stand by, and I'll get better as this as time goes on. So just stick with me. I promise it'll get better. <laughs> so. Yeah, we're just gonna look at upgrades. Colvin gave him zone upgrade. Just updating you of what's been going on uh, recently. So now we're gonna get, talk about what's going on on the screen here. Player development. Thomas Davis wants to talk to us about the the devs. Yeah, I already know about this. I've had two franchises before, so don't need to talk to him about this. So Matt, we lose our first game <laughs> to the Browns, evidently. Another sim, we win that one. See a few upgrades here, Ryan Kerrigan uh, specifically. Gonna upgrade him, look what he needs. Uh, definitely needs some power, uh, some speed runner, rusher. So, gonna give him that. Good upgrades there. AP, uh, definitely a Hall of Famer, has a record for most rushing yards in the game. Yeah, definitely going to continue him with elusive back. Scheme fit. Now, I want you guys to play a part uh, in this. As you see, Cody Latimer, just give him physical. He's not going to be playing very much. Well, these are second string, but it doesn't really matter. And then just the rest, we don't care about. We're just going to give him the top. I don't care about upgrading him. Well, I might later down the road, but I want you guys to help me. I want you guys to be basically part of this franchise. Tell me who you want me to trade, who you want me to extend, uh, what you want me to do with this franchise, basically. I want you guys to have a little bit of control over it. So, I want to know. Uh, down in the comments below, tell me what you want. Obviously, I want to try to keep it as realistic as possible, so... Don't tell me, uh, oh, Adrian Peterson for Patrick Mahomes. Uh, no, that's not going to work. It's obviously going to be rejected. Uh, so it's something that actually makes sense to help our team down the lo down the road. Definitely help me out by with that. Tell me who you want me to pick, and I'll definitely be okay with that. <laughs> As you see, 
playing our first game as the Redskins, uh, playing against the Falcons, which we have about a four overall difference in, not in our favor, so who knows what might happen. I'm honestly going to be surprised to see what happens. One thing I did realize while I was doing the while I'm doing this voiceover right now is I forgot to turn down the commentator audio and the music audio. So what I'm doing while editing is um, I'm moving the volume all the way down and applying that to all the clips, so I don't have to worry about getting copyright claim even though I only have 111 subscribers, but. See, Todd Gurley, I am using the 2020 rosters updated. Uh, I'm not using the 2019 rosters because I don't feel like there's a reason to do that. Edo Smith on the sidelines. Todd Gurley. Very good player. Unlike real life, he just wasn't very good this year. Got cut. Fair enough. Pays up for dead cap. Dwayne Haskins, definitely going to see what we can do with him this season. Oh crap, I forgot to... <laughs> I did not part out. Okay. Alright guys, I'm back. <laughs> Sorry for that. Uh, took a little break right there. As you see, the kickoff return, Edo Smith takes it back to about the 20 yard line. Matt Ryan, still a very great quarterback, holds up, but uh, I think next video I'm going to edit out uh, the play selection feature because I forgot to do that today. It's going to be very tedious, but uh, I don't mind doing that because it's going to be more, it's going to be a shorter video and more enjoyable, I think, for you guys. So you don't see what plays I pick. I see Hayden Hurst here. It's about seven. Yes. Yeah, he does get seven. You trade for like a fifth round draft pick in real life <laughs> from the Ravens. That was a pretty bad decision. Uh, but they do have Mark Andrews, who is a very good player. As Todd Gurley breaks a few and gets about a gets a 16 yard rush. But yeah, definitely next video I will be switching up. I will be editing the play selection. As Gurley another run. Three yards. See the offense there as it goes by on the screen. Second and seven snap, Gurley uh, gains nothing, two yards. Next video we will be seeing, it will be opening week, uh, Ionitis Payne and Young the D-line. Kerrigan Davis Sr., Foster and Sweat the linebackers. And you see Kendall Fuller, uh, Collins, Davis, and Darby. I do understand it is Ken Kendall Fuller, but I don't know, I just seem to say Kendall Fuller because it seems... More like that's what it'd be said as, but that's just me. Uh, snap and almost picked off by Fuller. Well, uh, my user wasn't very good there with Fuller. Probably could have had a pick, but intended for Jones and no good. Gonna be punted away here. Fourth and four. Shank to the la to the right. Yeah, at the ten yard line. No return by J D McKissick, former Lion. As you see, uh, well, in this technically in this game rookie, but it's second year quarterback Dwayne Haskins. As you see, this first play going to be called the mesh spot, and then just think about audibling it. Darius Skies in the backfield, going to see what, going to be very proud to see what he can do on our team. Christian Sr., Schwarzer, Rillier, Scherf, and another guy on the L and the McLaurin, Peterson, Geis, Rogers, and 
<laughs> and Latimer. That's your name. Hand off to Guy Skins. Nothing. Just snuffed. I am playing on all Madden difficulty, by the way. I This first game, as you will see, uh, missed a field goal. That is because I forgot to adjust the sliders before I played. Rookie mistake. I know. Uh, but... Next game, you will see, uh, I will have my sliders back and I will be playing like I normally do. As uh, so you see the Falcons defense, third and ten here. Gonna throw to the tight end, Rodgers, and that's picked off Deion Jones. And gets tackled. The snap, or the handoff to Gurley, gains about, actually loses three yards. Uh, Ioannidis, great uh, coverage there, or not coverage, but great defense there. Takes Gurley down. As you see, I will be using the uh, the corners a bit more. I do not want this to be boring, and as you see, Hayden Hurst touchdown. Actually, yeah, Hayden Hurst touchdown left him wide open. That was my mistake. But... I will be using the corners because I don't want it to be boring and me using the def the D line every single play. I want to mix it up a few plays. Uh, call all out blitzes. I'll be using the D line for that. But uh, any other play with zone coverage, I will be using the uh, the, def uh, the defensive backs. I don't want this to be boring and you just seeing me using the uh, Gold Gandy Golden takes us out. I hope Gandy going to get better. If you don't know, he has the virus. He got it about three weeks ago, so hopefully he's better at the time of recording this, which is Wednesday. Darius Sky's going to give him a stretch play here. Hand off, and gains about two. Three for one. Not a very good showing here right now for Darius. Another mesh spot here. Could have guys open on the wheel route. Oh, I had him wide open, but anyways, we get McLaurin here. Uh, do a possession catch first down. Now, I, I'm to be honest, I'm not expecting it to do very good uh, in this franchise for 75 overall. I'd be surprised if we even get six wins. Uh, I mean, we're okay, to be honest, but nothing special. I don't think we'll be doing the best. Yeah, pitch to Geis as he runs into his own uh, lineman and runs into a defender. Not one of my proudest moments, but it still happened. Uh, yeah, just got locked in 31 here. Could have Rodgers open first down. We sure do. First down. And. I see the play cut. And Rodgers first down. Uh, Tying attack favorite. Uh, probably becoming one of my most favorite plays uh, over the coming week. <laughs> over the past few weeks. I've been calling that a lot in my online franchise. Uh. I, I, I did a stream earlier, like a month ago, with that franchise, uh, but you probably won't be seeing that again. This will probably be the only thing that's on my YouTube channel. I, I have nothing else I could think of uploading. But yeah, for second and 12, and how did Trey Quinn catch that? I cannot wait to use Trey Quinn because Trey Quinn is a goat, to say the least. He is a very underrated player in Madden. And, oh my gosh, what was that throw, Haskins? I mean, to be fair, it was a lob pass, but definitely not where I was at in aiming the throw, which was Rodgers. See, 2019 draft class from real life. Atlanta has a 7-zip lead after that Hayden Hurst touchdown. And 
McLaurin gains about six. Five for seven passing for Dwayne Haskins. Gonna hand it off to Geis. Oh, and gets denied of the end zone. Comes up about a half yard short. I will be soon in the second quarter, uh, just FYI. Alright, we are back and we are done simming, so we will be coming back here in the second half. Uh, we do receive the kickoff. Gandy Golden set to return. Lined up behind his uh, men and gets to the 29, but not before he uh, draws the flag. It's going to be a personal foul face mask on the Falcons. Kicking team, Keith Smith, the fullback. Not a very good idea, Keith. J.D. McKissick in the backfield. 7 all game here in Washington. We did score a touchdown during the sim. And 2nd and 11 after McKissick loses the yard. And gets sacked. I couldn't find anyone to throw to. My bad. Davidson with the sack. I'm going to call the PA deep, deep seams here. And, oh, they sniffed that out bad. O Olaquan, uh with the sack. I don't, I, I definitely know one of the trades or draft things that we look at uh, this season, yeah, for however long it goes on, probably will go on for a while, is we need to find some O-line help. And fast <laughs> because our O line is not very good. Our only good player on the O line is Brandon Scherf. And Brandon Scherf is okay, even though he's an 88 overall. He's okay. See me using Kendall Fuller here. And right here, as soon as they motion him out, I, I, sm I smell that a run's coming here. And of course it does, but to the side where Kendall. Fuller previously was. It was just my luck in a tier gain for Gurley, so. Matt Ryan trying to give the Falcons the lead here. And Julio is usually a better route runner than that. Runs right out of bounds. And first down, Hayden Hurst wide open. Matt Ryan under center. Gurley in the backfield does not throw to Gurley. He's in the O-line here. And gets past one, gets past two, breaks two, actually, and gets the first down. As I mess up there and don't forget that the play was called and just leave Kendall there as they get a seven yard rush or gain. Excuse me. <laughs> and a sack by Jonathan Allen. And. Oh, and they get a big gain as you missed that part. Uh, sorry about that. Something with the editing program cut it out. So that's my bad right there. <laughs> so let's move on to the next play. And I'm thinking about... Uh, so what I'm thinking about is I'm probably going to have two video clips. Uh, I'm going to do the first half in one video clip and the other half in two... and uh, the other half in another video clip. I'm also going to put the quarters up to 10 minutes because 8 minutes feels a little bit too short as Edo Smith just absolutely shreds my secondary. But yeah, I'm going to... Okay, as they do the point after. But right here is where I'm going to do something uh, different. I'm going to... Ask you a question, 
and see who's been watching this long. So if I see a comment down there, I'm gonna like it. If I get, if the answer is good, uh, not saying it's not going to, but my question to you is, who is your dark horse pick to make the Super Bowl? Not something like the Saints or the Chiefs. Those are obvious teams. Those are very good teams. But I want to know if you had to pick one team. Doesn't matter from which division. One dark horse team to make the playoffs. And I want to see what you guys have to say below down in the comments. Uh, just to see who's been watching until this point. Second and five. Going to run it with uh, Dwayne Haskins. Eight yard rush. I didn't rush it with Haskins very much. Just, I don't know. Just kind of trusted him. Probably trusted him too much as we're down right now. That's because the Falcons are a better team. The PA bubble Y over one of my favorite plays right now in Madden. And McKissick gains nothing. You just gotta have a great uh, running back to make that play work. And JD McKissick is not very good. I'm gonna give him not gonna give him that. I'm just gonna call this play. Three wide receiver, one half one tight end and one halfback set. And Trey Quinn making another excellent catch. Definitely can tell that I'm going to love using him this uh, this franchise. And yes, I will be using the 2021 draft class for those of you asking. Uh, which probably wasn't very many, but I will be using the 2021 draft class. So... If we wanted to, I could get Trevor Lawrence with the second overall pick. I'm not going to because we have a second year quarterback, Dwayne Haskins. Who, even though Trevor Lawrence is an 82 overall superstar X Factor quarterback, how do I know that? Because I played this game for a while now. Uh, I still don't think I'm going to be replacing Dwayne Haskins. No matter how bad his season was, I don't think I'm going to be doing that. As you see right here, uh, this play coming up, this is the play I was talking about where uh, I needed to turn up my sliders because this, even though it was accurate and it was a good kick with the wind facing my way, I still missed it. So I boosted up the slider and I should be making that kick tomorrow uh, whenever I play the next game. Anyways, they get the ball at the 46 yard line, 14-7 game. Man, <laughs> even in my return to YouTube, it's it's been a long time since I've commentated a video. My throat is starting to get uh, scratchy because of how much I've been commentating this uh, whole video. So if it's too much, <laughs> gonna be screwed. But hey, it's whatever. It's my return to YouTube, and I hope and the people that watch, I'm gonna do it for you guys. Uh, I'm gonna stick it out for you guys. I'm gonna. Do all I can. Make sure my throat doesn't keep on being scratchy when I commentate. So it should be better next video. Third and 17. Seven minutes and change left in the quarter. Third and 17. Should make it. I don't see why they wouldn't. Uh, and no, they won't. Uh, settle with the sack. Just gonna let it roll out of bounds. Eight AP in the game, as you see right there. Definitely a Hall of Famer, even though what he did, which was unfortunate. Definitely gonna bring him down as one of the best players in the NFL, uh, running backs uh, to be specific. But. Still, Adrian Peterson, even though he's older now, he's still very valuable as... I don't know what that throw was from Kyle Allen. I was aiming for Trey Quinn, and he just decided to throw it to <laughs> Defender. Uh, hey, man. Kyle, if you want to be an Atlanta Falcon, just tell me, man. I can do the trade right now. You don't, you don't have to cost us the preseason game, man. That's fine. 
Just tell me you want to go, and I'll, I could continue to. Yeah, it's, I read that play perfectly. And make him lose two. Third and ten. Gonna be uh, using app key here as they lead. I leave the defender wide open. Doesn't fumble. Twenty-eight yards for Gage. Wow. Weird set they're using there. Have all their uh, defender, uh, their O line on the left side and one player on the right. So it was obviously a run there. Edo Smith gaining a few. Ruben Foster, former 49er. <laughs> How do I know that? 49er fan here. And, oh my, I that's a touchdown. I don't know about you, but that is a touchdown. Thankfully, they didn't call that. Don't know how they didn't call that, <laughs> but it's whatever, you know. And gets denied and runs into his own man. Uh, how many times have I had that happen to me or countless? As they're just going to settle for the field goal here. Put them up 10. As you see, the CPU rarely miss these kicks, so obviously a makeable kick. Three minutes and change left. J.D. McKissick makes one miss, but it doesn't really do much after. 25 yard, uh, third yard return down to the 25. Gonna send AP back in, uh, hand it off to him. Run into a man and gain five. So good, good rush by AP, averaging five. So they only gave him four there. Did not realize that. As I don't know what that throw was, I overthrew him. And it was going to be a good catch if we had Dwayne Haskins in there, but no. Did not have that happen. And I don't know what that throw was. Your guess is as good as mine. Honestly, though, your guess is as good as mine. Don't ask me what that throw was. I don't know myself. Hopefully Kyle Allen gets better accuracy before he steps in. If uh, Dwayne Haskins ever gets injured, knock on wood. That doesn't happen. It's deflected on the 4th and 1. And we're obviously going to lose this game here. Uh, not much we could do. Just the Atlanta Falcons played better than us all in all. Gonna be ran by Edo Smith. Breaks a tackle somehow. Uh, EA Physics, man. Me, personally, myself, I'm not one who likes to hate on games. I, I try to find the better in games, you know. But that right there kind of screwed me, even though we were already losing. And I don't know why, but uh, watch this epic scrubbery by me. Uh, not... Calling timeouts during the two minute <laughs> warning. Why? Because I forgot about the clock. It's not because I uh, was okay with, well, I was okay with losing, but it's not because I knew that I was letting the clock run down. I did it purposely so the video wouldn't be long, but just because I forgot about the game clock. I probably should have remembered that the Game clock was under two when they were letting it run down to three seconds left on the game clock. Or the play clock, excuse me. As Edo Smith just shreds my D and that's that sounded uh don't take that out of context, kids. He shreds the secondary, that's what I meant to say. And yeah. Enjoyed the last 30 seconds of this game, which I don't know how I didn't see that they were running down the clock because it was less than two minutes. As you see, a, a wildcat here. Yeah, I didn't expect a wildcat either. <laughs> but they pull it out and, and uh, the game's going to end. Five, four, three. You know the rest. And we lose in our first game in the Redskins franchise. 17-7. Uh, I mean... I play very bad, not gonna lie, uh, but it's the preseason. You're supposed to get better as the preseason goes on. 
So, nice screenshots. Could use one for the thumbnail. I forgot to do that during the video. That could easily be the thumbnail right there, the Traquin catch. But yeah, I'm actually gonna put some work into my thumbnail. I'm gonna get uh I'm gonna end up getting a I'm gonna end up <laughs> I'm gonna end up getting a screenshot from this video of a play from those screenshots and make it the thumbnail. I'm gonna do it for every video when there is a screenshot. Uh and I'm gonna have the Redskins logo and then the episode that we are currently on. So yeah, should be fun. Gonna put a lot of hard work into this as you see the non worthy upgrades dimension. Pretty good upgrade for Sal's even though he didn't go up in overall. Don't know why I said it's not worth mentioning when it really isn't and I just did. But yeah, uh, I hope you guys like this video. I'm gonna do it a bit early just so I don't mess up here. But uh, I hope you guys really did enjoy this video. If you did, I would really appreciate a like, comment, and subscribe uh, if you appreciate it. Uh, it was very easy to come back to YouTube. Uh, it's been a while. Uh, just had no motivation because my dream was to become a successful YouTuber. And now I know it's probably not going to happen, but I can still do it because that's, that's fair. I mean, I feel like doing it because... It's fun for me, but I'm I'm okay with not being a successful YouTuber if it doesn't happen. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, as I said, uh, please stay tuned. I'm going to be uploading more frequently this franchise. I don't know why there are two buster screens. Don't ask me. But anyways, guys, just hope you guys are having a good day, evening, night, whenever you guys are watching this. And uh, see you later. Bye.